tied through these first few minutes before we actually get to the part you paid for. This is just gravy. So, all of you right now are sitting in the historic Clinton Street Theater. The Clinton Street Theater is now officially over 100 years old. That's pretty fucking amazing. It's been here so fucking long. Back in the day, you used to have strippers up here. Ooh, look, look. Maybe you'll get lucky tonight. Maybe you know what piece of this? Show me your tits! Yeah. In addition to that, you are at the Rocky Horror Picture Show, which has been going here at the Clinton for over 37 years. Yeah. Pretty amazing. That makes it the single longest running Midnight Rocky screening in the fucking world. Yeah. Which might as well be the universe for all we know. You know, it's like everything. It's pretty big. So, if you guys are interested, and being a part of the Clinton Street Theater, not missing out on any of the cool movies, perhaps volunteering here, get, get in for free movies. There's lots of community theater events that go on here, including Monkey with a Hat on Productions. Always cool shows, go to cstpdx.com. It is your gateway to everything Clinton Street. So, so, so I was walking in here, I heard that there might be some people here who, uh, I ain't never been to the Rocky Horror Picture Show before. That, that's kind of bullshit. So, can I please have all my filthy, nasty, slutty virgins, please stand up for me? We got a fair drop. All right, all my virgins, please join me on stage. You sweet young things, you. All right. Oh, we got a fresh bumper crop tonight. That looks like the bra that chick on the Seinfeld episode tried to make it do a shirt right there. I think she's pulling it off, first of all. Holy oh, shit, we got more than I thought. All right, that's like half the audience. Yeah, we got the bra. Oh yeah, we got drunk. <laughs> we got Mo Red Eddie here. He's <laughs> Oh, yeah. He just woke up on that and put in a gutter on Hawthorne this morning. Yeah, that's how he just looked when he woke I up. Change. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> All right, so you filthy, filthy people, you. Well, it's my sacred duty to uh, pop your guys' cherries. Don't so. do that either. <laughs> oh, right there. Bring them up! Bring them up! I ain't gonna force you to do nothing, but you're being shamed by the entire audience, and I'll tell you what, guys. Bring them up! If they don't get up, if they don't get up, that seat section, that's the place to throw your toast, so. Oh, we got one brave girl. There we go. There we go. Aw, oh, isn't that nice? So, you get to sit, no, you don't get to join the crowd. No, you're front and center, girl. So are you. You're not immune. Get up. You're, yeah, you. No, the other girl who tried to say she wasn't a fucking virgin. All right. So, what game are we gonna play here? <laughs> All right, so we're gonna play a little game. I need you guys to do me a favor and turn around, look at the lovely virgin scum in front of you, and pick a victim. Just your teammate for this for this sport that we're gonna play. Pick, pick a random. Virgin. I go with the dude with the fucking red panties and the pearls. <laughs> That's my choice right there. <laughs> All right, man. There we go. There we go. Awesome. So here at the Rocky Horror Picture Show, we like to get a little freaky. We gotta like to let our hair down, get a little debaucherous, sometimes kill people. But when we do this, we like to do it safely, and that means using condoms. So, so we have a way we like to liven it up, make the foreplay more interesting. Our lovely young sacrifices here are going to show us the Rocky Horror Picture way of opening these condoms. And they are going to be using only their teeth. So, if you please can't clench this between your lovely pearly whites for me. There we go. And if you would do the same here. There we go. So, please face your teammates. Here. <laughs> All right, 
On the count of three, you guys are going to open it. If you guys use your hands or anything, everybody's going to laugh at you and throw a toast at you. So, let's give them a count of three, guys. On the count of three. One, two, two three. three. Oh, Pearl's here is going hard. Oh, look at his hand on her back. He's getting all into it. Oh, wow. Wow, I'm... <laughs> What's your name? What are you doing there? <laughs> Alright, big round of applause for our legends. Alright, you guys can go have a seat now. Thank you very much. Not everybody, just them. You're hunchback and stay right the hell there. <laughs> Alright, so we gotta go. A bunch more. Let's get... <laughs> All right, so you come here, <laughs> and um, uh, Trailer Park Eddie, you come over here, <laughs> and I need you guys to turn around and also pick two, or pick a victim each, to be your partners in this lovely, lovely game. Break the mold, Eddie. Pick a dude. <laughs> all right. All right. So, if all of you would please come down to the front of the stage. You can hop. I wouldn't suggest with you. Yeah. This girl knows what she's knows what she's up to. She's climbed what thousands of stairs onto the stage at the strip clubs <laughs> in heels. To let our heels All out. right, of that. Anyway, <laughs> so separate it out a little bit. Our two teams here are going to show us the proper way to eat a delicious grandmother's cookie. So who's feeling hungry out of the two teams? And you probably ain't eaten in like a week, man. <laughs> well, the evens are good now. <laughs> he just hangs outside a pock pock, waiting for them to throw out the garbage. All right. So who's hungry? Raise your, raise your hand if you want to be the cookie eater. Well, one of you's got to do it, unless you're gluten free. Birthday of one of these you're gluten free? That's such a fucking cop out. I get a little fucking cop out, like, I'm gluten free. Wink, wink. All right. All right, we got a cookie eater. That means you are sitting on the stage. And whoever, so are you eating? Sure, why not? That means you, my good friend, are sitting on the stage. Oh man, I forgot to ask if anyone was under 18. Well, like, this guy's 25. Let's just see. So, all right. So, now, why don't we just kind of lean back a little bit, kind of spread your legs a little bit, get comfortable. Yeah! Give the audience a show. There we go. So, we're all, you guys are going to be eating these cookies. I'm proud of it. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah. All right, put that right there. There you go. Oh, oh. I don't want to rub your jaw. Just like you help me out a little bit. Thank you. I will rub your jaw, but that's extra. All right, so our lovely, lovely. Virgins who are going to be gnawing on these screens, please assume the position in front of your partner. <laughs> on your knees. <laughs> All right, you got to put your hands firmly behind your backs, and on the count of three, audience, they're gonna they're gonna eat these cookies for all their worth. There's not twenty bucks in it for you, Eddie. <laughs> <laughs> All right, audience, on the count of three. One, two, three! Eat that cookie! Oh, Eddie's a monster. Do you ask the whole thing? You don't stop until she comes. Come on, keep going. Is there blood? Oh, that's lipstick. Okay, she's leaving a lipstick. She's just kind of licking it. You gotta swallow. You gotta show me that mouth, Eddie. 
that mouth that many that was the last thing many squirrels saw. <laughs> <laughs> we got to, you're not done. <laughs> you are done now, though, because almost Eddie just won the cooking eating competition. Yeah. Yeah. All right, you guys can go have a seat now. Thank you very much. Just, just put it on the floor. They, they, we pay people good money to clean up after your nasty shit. So. <laughs> My nasty shit is in a bucket in the back room. It's just collecting. All right. So, let's see. Can I get you four? All right, let's, let's do, yeah, let's, these six on this side of the stage, come follow me. All right, so you three, come over to the beginning of this aisle, please and line up like this, okay? So one person here, one person here, and back up. So you're oh, yeah. doing the same thing on the other side. So just face one person, one person, one person. One person. One person. <laughs> all right, perfect. I, I'm glad you guys are all ready. Oh, back up, you're getting a head start. You gotta be right at the line here. I'm trying to cheat already. All right, we're gonna play one of my favorite games. This game is called Brokeback Mountain. I'm going to need two experienced Rocky veterans to be judges for this. I see some hands, please. All right, you, please stand up. Uh, you at the head of that aisle, you at the head of that aisle. You're gonna hold your hands out and wait for the first team to high five. That'll be the winning team. So how this works, how Brokeback Mountain works is we're gonna reenact one of Hollywood's greatest films. <laughs> So what's going to happen is you guys are going to line up, facing that way, and the last person is going to get on their hands and knees and crawl through the legs of the person in front and then stand up, and then we're going to continue that in a train until one team emerges victorious and high fives our lovely volunteers up top. All right, does everybody understand the rules? Under the legs. Under the legs. All right. This is not as exciting as, you, as I'm making it sound, but on the count of three, one, two, three, go! No, back of the line, back of the line goes. No, don't, don't fucking, ah, oh, Jesus. A good old-fashioned Rocky Horror Picture Show Orgasm Contest! Yeah. So normally I start from this side, but I have a feeling you're gonna shine, so you're last. Alright, sweetheart, what's your name? Megan. Megan. Megan's a classy girl, likes to have fun, take long walks on the beach, and squeal like a dolphin while she's being fucked. So, <laughs> so let's hear, Whoa. let's hear Megan, Megan's best dolphin orgasm, please. That's up to you inside. You're the old man. <laughs> Judging. 
Yes, you have to be judged. Yes. And then you have to dress up like Betty in a wedding dress, and then you have to dance like Frank Krueger, and then you have to uh, stop those things. <laughs> All right. Now, what is your name? Diana. All right, so Diana is the name of one of my favorite super heroines of all time, Wonder Woman. Can you give us, please, your best Wonder Woman orgasm? Like an Amazon. Like an Amazon. Amazon. Like an Amazon. 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 Amazon.
I went to go see a new doctor, I got new insurance, and uh, the doctor, this hot female doctor immediately says, after examining for just a second, she says, man, you just, you really need to stop masturbating. And I say, why, doc? I'm a healthy male. And she says, because I'm trying to examine you. <laughs> So at the Rocky Horror Picture Show, you do not have to stay in your seats. You do not have to shut your mouth. You can get up, dance. In fact, this stage after I leave it, it's fucking yours. You guys can have fun up here. But there are a couple rules. Uh, 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 Alright, so we have some callbacks in the theater, but we uh, there's a couple things we need standard. Um, if you see a person, you're allowed to yell whatever the hell you want at the movie, but if you see a particular characters on the screen, if you see a guy wearing glasses, probably in his underwear, his name is Brad Majors, and he is asshole. an asshole. Asshole! Don't let him know. And if you see Janet Weiss, I'll tell you what, she's not that wise. She's a fucking slut! She's very slut. And if you, see the, if you see the criminologist, also the man with no neck, no you just scream! So if you guys want to get up on stage, all we ask is, especially during the Time Warp, which is an amazing song, that when you come up, you enter from this side of the stage and you exit from that side of the stage. Which side of the stage do we enter from? And which side of the stage do we exit from? This side of the stage. All right, you guys, you guys are pros. So when the song The Time Warp comes on, most of the song is pretty self-explanatory, but when we say the words, let's do the time warp again, there is a particular way. I learned it coming here on this stage of the Clinton in 1999. That's how old I am. And, uh, 1999? I am 1999, yes. I'm on sale. I was almost oh, since 2000. Fuck your boys! All right, so here's, here's how we do it. And here's the way I learned it, the way we do it at the Clinton. So we get to let's do the time warp again, we go. Let's do the time warp again. Big fucking jazz hands. Jazz hands! Wow. All right. Again, again. No. <laughs> <laughs> I only have to do it once. It's in my fucking contract. All right. Oh, now it's time for the rules. Duck, duck, duck. Fuck the rules. Fuck the rules. You would. But you can't find its buckle. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so, first rule is, there are no water sports allowed in this theater, that means no squirt guns, no water balloons, no cups of water, no peeing on each other. If you want to get wet, you're just going to have to think dirty thoughts, people, before you have ruined it. I'm sorry. Water bad, water good. Oh, yes, yes. What the spit? Let me give you the next rule so you can do the follow-up to that fucking Metallicops meme from, like, fucking 39 years ago. Alright, second rule is, no fire. No matter how long you hold up your lighter, Rocky will not begin singing Freebird. So we can also we can't have fire because we don't have the water to put it out. You know, people fuck shit up. So when you're on stage, there are some forbidden areas. This door back here is forbidden. That door over there, and those doors are forbidden. Who is bidden? That door, that door is lions. Over there in the back is tigers, and back behind that hallway is it's a hallway full of angry transvestites. Oh my. This right here is known locally as the Line of Death. <laughs> if you cross the Line of Death, you will be summarily executed. Woo! I love that! <laughs> Alright, so if you guys have props, you guys have your toast, your rice, your newspapers, all that, and you're gonna throw that shit. If you are sitting in the front of the theater, we, we want to be careful not to damage the holy screen here. So if you're sitting in the front, please throw your props up and backwards. If you're sitting in the back, please throw your props up and forwards. And if you're sitting in the middle, just throw a walk. Yeah. Thank you. Okay, you got it. If you guys smoke, please smoke 10 feet away from the door and be quiet. Uh, it isn't an in-and-out thing, but please be quiet because the neighbors did not read the lease. <laughs> so That's their problem. And if you have a cell phone, Turn it the fuck off. Come okay, on. Okay, I'm on. All right. <laughs> I'm too loud. Let's I got that. All right. All right. What's long, hard, and has coming in, guys? A cucumber. You guys have dirty minds. You know what the difference between uh, being hungry and horny is? Where you stick that cucumber. 